is getting very hot. Uh, I can't, I can't put my hand in now, you know. So I can hover my hand on top of the mouth here, you know. Look at this, and it's. I can't think of putting my hand in. I must have put uh, probably a couple of uh, kilos in here. It's a lump of charcoal. I probably will put another half a kilo, maybe one kilo more in 10 more minutes and we'll wait for another 15 minutes and then it should be should be ready to cook and so you're talking about I have put around three kilos of charcoal this is the SS2 model so three kilos of charcoal uh, will give me more than two hours of cooking time it's it's getting very hot it's getting very very hot I can't I can't I can't place my okay I'm back again so I topped it up with another probably half a kilo because I don't think it requires any more so I would say in total I have put probably 2.5 kilos in there again this is the SS2 model and this is the charcoal bag I bought from from the Puri uh, <clears throat> that's them absolutely brilliant brilliant piece of kit so I reckon it should be ready very soon now another 10 minutes give it another 10 minutes or so I've got my chicken ready it's already been marinated I marinated that last night so I will try and send some more videos so that you can see but yeah this is the SS2 Ultima model came with the recipe book that's what I'm following is the tandoori quick fix chicken that's a recipe I'm gonna okay so I think this is ready I I can't even I'm quite high here look at this I can't I can't can't keep my hand here it's very very hot I'll wait for another five minutes for flames to die um, and with the with the skewer I'm gonna actually break that whatever I made well you call it a pyramid call it a pyramid so I'm gonna break that so that it lies flat and what I'm gonna do is I'm going to actually put this uh, put this back on uh, leaving look at this probably I don't know a little bit open so yeah so it's still breathing and the flame should die in the next five minutes um, again want you to thank Puri Tandoos for sending me a set of four these mugs um, because I sent few videos to them and they seem to love it I'm, I've not seen those videos on their Facebook or YouTube page but these are the mugs they sent set of four lovely and that's my beer so I will be sending you pictures for okay that's the uh, the marination that I've done here as you can see a uh, lovely tandoori chicken so I'm sorry it was not the tandoori fix uh, quick fix I think it's on the other page uh, but I did the uh, the tandoori chicken it is absolutely brilliant it comes out so good uh, this is the recipe book that I got with the tandoor uh, it's uh, I bought the SS2 Ultima model not uh, I think a couple of years ago maybe three years ago done many barbecues uh, brilliant everyone loves it that's a recipe book I got I've, my favorite is what I'm doing today which is the which is the tandoori chicken on page 119 so that's the book that's the chicken that's me we'll send you some more pictures maybe a video once it's all it's all in that's my chicken that's all gone in wish you could you could smell you could smell it oh my god it's, it's absolutely brilliant uh, loving it loving it so I reckon it's gonna take another 20 minutes and it should be all done uh, not sure uh, whether you would do this or not but it, with my experience I generally put the lid leaving leaving only slightly open of course you can't close it fully because the skewers are popping out uh, it gives that char grill flavor you know which of course you cannot get by using a normal barbecue uh, as you can see the ventilation door is slightly open you can say probably I don't know maybe 20% or so uh, just to just so that you know it's breathing it's breathing it's still breathing keeping the temperature inside it maintains the temperature it's very hot very very hot 
and uh, uh, well I can still touch this lid so that's not hot let me see that's hot but it it will not scald your skin it's hot it's hot yeah lovely okay guys this is uh, 15 minutes into cooking and a sizzling is I think it's another probably five minutes or so five maybe ten minutes it should be all done and sorry I forgot to mention Puri Tandus they also sent me some packs of spices they have started doing now for the uh, for the tandoori cooking and uh, I've used all the spices from them uh, and trust me guys the I wish if if you know I could send you the this uh, the aroma and you know the fresh uh, these are all ground spices uh, I've got uh, which one is that I've got the meat masala here I use this garam masala and I've got few other chicken tandoori chicken masala and it's coming out very very good so I think it's nearly done here so another another five ten ten minutes so I started uh, I'm looking at my watch I started an hour ago by putting my first uh, charcoal by lighting the charcoal and it's one hour and five minutes is done maybe another 10 minutes so one hour 15 minutes from start to finish uh, not the chicken but from from lighting the charcoal to the complete cooking it took me an hour and fifth will take an hour and 15 minutes so this is my last video here and I will send you some pictures when it's all done but I'm loving it already I think it's it's nearly done so I'm okay this looks done to me absolutely done so but what I'm gonna do is I'm going to use this butter ghee I'm going to use this butter ghee to garnish it that gives that you know the the best part of it you know when you when you garnish it you know it gives you the slight salted and you know buttery flavor so I'm gonna garnish it slightly ever so slightly and put it back in for not more than five minutes because if you keep it more then it's gonna it's gonna start to burn because the, the heat inside is is so, is so hot inside so I'm gonna keep it only for five minutes look at this I'm gonna just so that's what I'm doing just uh, look at this dip your brush in there and just go around it well don't get me wrong it's it's absolutely done now it's been uh, 20 maybe 25 minutes and it's done now but I thought you know I'll just do the last bit just to give it that edge and then it'll be done the tandoori oven here 25 minutes later it's still it's still hot I can't no I can't I can't it's still very very hot okay guys so sorry I didn't take the last picture of the chicken uh, which was done I was starving so my family and uh, <laughs> we just finished it all beautiful these are my, my skewers here um, this is still so hot I can have probably two more sessions here you know uh, it's still kind of very angry inside you know is is I can't I can't I'm just trying to put my hand in and it's still so hot so uh, it was around couple of hours ago when I first uh, light the charcoal and uh, it's one hour 15 minutes later we have done one tandoori session loads of chicken we're going to have now because I know it's still so hot we're going to we're going to have um, a pineapple a tandoori pineapple I'm not sure whether you have heard of that or not but it's a, it's a dessert so we're gonna have a tandoori pineapple with some ice cream uh, so that's what next is coming thank you